Let's face it, summer travel can be a challenge. When you make the right decision, everything goes great. But when you make the wrong decision, well, it actually gums up the works for you and for everyone else. So this morning, we're going to play our own version of that old game show, Truth or Consequences, where the consequences of making the wrong decision can add up to misery. So you're about to go through airport security. What's the one thing you need to do? Always do potty breaks before. Make sure your phone's charged. Truth is, you should have your ID and ticket already in your hand or your phone display already showing the boarding pass. The consequence of not doing that? Anger. Don't be the one in line that's going, oh, digging through all your stuff. Why should you never pack a block of cheese or chocolate in your carry-on? Food is not allowed, right? Because it'll melt. Well, the kids kind of know the answer. You're going to just hide like little tiny explosives. Truth is, the TSA says it can clutter bags and obstruct clear images on the x-ray machine. The consequence? Your bag gets a hand inspection, slowing your trip to the gate. How do you confirm which gate to go to? Checking the list of the monitor and then finding the, your flight. Truth is, the problem, of course, is you can't always trust the monitors. This Atlanta flight here, 261, shows on time. But when you put it in the Internet, canceled. Put in the airline and flight number into Google and voila, it confirms your gate. Consequence, you walk all the way to gate C4, only to find out your flight has been moved to A42. Why should you have an empty water bottle for your trip? Actually, I don't know. The truth is... You could fill it up with your water fountain because water over there is like four dollars. On to your gate. You're waiting to board now. What do you need to do? Just I be guess. patient and wait your turn. Truth is, get the book, Kindle, earbuds out of your bag before getting on board and standing in the aisle. Get all your things that you need so you don't have to jump over me. Consequence, if you do it on board, you slow everyone behind you as you fumble before putting your bag in the overhead or incur the wrath of your seatmate. Right now we're at 21,000 feet. We'll be landing soon. When we do, what is the first thing you should do when we touch down? I mean, I don't know. Truth, stay seated. On average, when a plane lands, it takes 14 minutes to taxi to the gate, then another six minutes for them to finally open the door. And here in row 11, it takes, on average, 13 minutes before you're finally off the plane. The final hack may sound funny, but it can mean the difference between a great trip and a really, really long trip. Why should you travel with two clothespins? Keep your pants up if you're, you lose a button or something. If you're like with bathing suits and stuff to hang it on the line in the, in the room. Truth, the clothespins seal up ill-fitting curtains in hotel rooms, keeping early morning light out. Consequence, if you forget, you'll rise with the sun and that can make for a miserable day. So you guys are a lot more truth than consequences. What are your favorite travel hacks? Well, don't bring them. Yeah. <laughs> we, did, we didn't talk Leave about any hacks behind. for the toddler, but yeah. I, I have to say, what? iPad. Okay. Yeah, iPad. iPad, you have yeah. to. You so, have to let them watch things. And, I, and at the beginning of, of parenthood, I felt bad about doing yes. that. Now, yeah. I think when you're traveling, it's like pirate's rules. Anything goes. Yes. You yes. can watch the iPad all day. You can Absolutely. eat snacks. Terrible. Yes. Right. Parlay. What do you think, Carson? You travel with your kids all I know. the time. Well, in, in an effort to, to, you know, so they don't bother everybody on the plane, you do yeah. end up sort of checking your rules that are at home sort of at the airport door. Yes. Just so that they can. Yeah. How do you also, handle oh, a meltdown, though? Yeah. Well, I think. You go out you, on the wing. I think. You know. <laughs> that's right. Just, just like William Shatner. No, uh, you basically, I think people care if you make an effort yes. to control yeah. the kids. They know that you're not going to be able to yeah. completely, but just make an Try. effort. Try. Yes. Yeah. All right. Mm. That's good. Carrie, thank you for that. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.